Ciao, oh, grazie. You have been very impressive today. Uh, it's something that you ex expected, or you have been surprised by yourself of this performance today? Well, I was hoping on it because uh, two years ago I did kind of the same. Uh, I packed with the yellow jersey, tried to keep my uh, jersey in the mums. And uh, yeah, today I waited for the right moment. I think I jumped as last guy to the to the big group, uh, which cost a lot of, lot of a lot of energy. But uh, afterwards, I was feeling really good on the climbs, and uh, yeah, if they gave me seven minutes, I knew it would be possible to to keep the yellow jersey. Y a-t-il une question en salle de presse Is there any question in the press room for Greg Van Avermaet Question pour la salle de presse. Question for the press room. Can you explain us how you prepared for uh, the Tour de France in the Alpes uh, I prepared just like normal, uh, just the good, good training uh, uh, with my family. Uh, good good intensity training and uh, yeah, also focus on, on uh, uh, enjoying myself, I think that's the most important for me. I'm not a guy who is really focused the whole day on cycling and uh, yeah, I just like to do things, uh, riding with my Vespa around, we went to a lake, we went uh, swimming and uh, I think for me mentally uh, it's even as, as important as phys physically and uh, I think uh, yeah, it's a preparation that that I do for years already, and it works. So I think uh, it's a good it's a good sign, and I'm really happy with uh, with my legs uh, this week because you always have to wait if, if it really works or not. Les deux dernières questions, s'il vous plaît, two last questions, please. Est-ce qu'il y a une question pour la salle de presse? Question for the press room, please. Greg, great ride the mountains today. What are your goals and ambitions for tomorrow's mountain stage? Yeah, I think today was a, a, a good day, but tomorrow will be a super hard day. Uh, uh, from in the past, I know I have super good day behind the rest day, and uh, I can go over my limits sometimes. But uh, most of the time, I pay it back the second day, so uh, I'm not expecting that much. It's a super short stage. Two, uh, three mountain climbs, so I think it's uh, yeah for me a bit too much, and I'm really happy to extend one day extra today. But uh, I'm really giving my chance uh, zero for tomorrow. Et la dernière question pour le maillot jaune. Last question for the yellow jersey. Question pour la salle de presse. Est-ce qu'il y en a encore une? Question pour Hugo Corvitz en salle de presse. S'il vous plaît. Alright, I think it's different than uh, winning a stage for sure. Uh, uh, I try to win stages, that's always been my goal. But uh, if you can uh, you come close like in Ruba and you cannot win, I think this yellow jersey is a really good uh, different thing I think uh, leader jersey in the Tour de France is probably as big as a stage win and uh, yeah I'm really enjoying it every every day that I have it and uh, like uh, like uh, you said I wrote already 11 days in my career not a, not a lot of the Belgian guys have this so I think it's uh, it's a really honor to to ride with this every day and that's why I also try to defend it as good as possible and I also, also want to be a, a yellow jersey that shows himself you know I try I try to attack in Ruba. I uh, try to attack today, and I think it's uh, it's really cool to be in the front in this jersey.